Good morning. Good morning. We just seen another white squirrel we ran did. across the road. I think that's why the dog is barking. From the white squirrels? Yeah. <laughs> They're everywhere now, guys. They are. Everywhere. We were actually reading more under the white squirrel and um, said something about like 40% of the population. Yeah, and as of 2011, right? Or 19. Yeah, I, 2000. It was like 2011. 2011 yeah, 40% yeah, so of the population of squirrels down here. Yeah. Were so, white. and wait, I thought I saw Jim made a comment about. A oh, there's another one. It ran. Hold on. You want me to get it? Okay. Right. We were just talking about it, guys. That's funny. They're everywhere here. 40% of the population of squirrels down here in Bavard now. I think it's more. It might be, this. yeah, definitely more. And they're making it their way up towards us in those rivers. Yeah. Cool. But anyway, what I was saying is I thought I saw that Jim said that there was a town in South Carolina too that is very populated with the white squirrel. And they are, they're not albino. No. They are white squirrels because they actually, sometimes they even have like black on them a little bit. Like a stripe, um, but their hanging. eyes have pigment. Yeah, and Rachel was reading that the ones we have here came from two squirrels in 1947 or something. Yeah, it was like really a, a long circus. time ago. A circus was traveling through or something and the truck overturned. And apparently two squirrels escaped. And, and um, I yeah. guess bred and they're, they're more, yeah. I guess they started it's breeding dominant. with all, I guess. Mm -hmm. I don't know why but, it's still yeah. over there, but we're gonna get out and mow this one. Rachel's gonna have to move sprinklers again, but that's all right. That's all right. Yeah. Everywhere, there's two there. What are the odds of seeing three white squirrels? Oh, right. And see that one right there does have a little bit of black on him. Yeah. Those are her back. See. It's been. I guess that's when they breed with the gray squirrels. I guess. I don't know. I think that it's just sometimes they. I don't. I'm not exactly sure, but. I was reading that something. So there's you guys' um, nature for the day. Yeah. You get to see two white squirrels. Oh, there is a gray squirrel over there, too. Yeah? Yeah. So, guys, this is one that they will, they have been watering, and we put that next round of ironite and pre-emergent. And look how nice it looks. Nice and green. Not bad. Coming back. And they got about a quarter inch of rain, so on top of watering. So, not bad. So I got that one done. Looking nice, right? I had to go a little shorter where the clover was. Yeah. Not bad. Huh. It's hot. So we're back on a break. I want to check and see if that bird came back to its little nesting. I think it might be one of them. No, I think... I don't know if they lay on them eggs or not. So this is the next one, guys. That thing looks dry, don't it? Yeah, what is it, a week? Yeah, this is a week. We're the still gonna mow it. The back looks better. Because the dog gets lost if we don't mm -hmm. mow it. Yeah. <laughs> I hope the back looks better. Hopefully, but I'm thinking that hill part where we put that sod's dead. Okay, we're gonna get out and mow this. I'll get you the after. So we're done this one. Look at the difference in the hill where you don't get much water on it. And they've been watering down here where it's nice and green. Rachel's blowing everything off. Not bad, not bad. <sighs> it's hot and dry. Look at the sod we put down. It's still alive, but that was stuff we cut up when we did the drain. Okay, let me get to doing some more work. Now that's a storm cloud, guys, but once again, it's going just a tad to the west and north of us. Maybe we'll get lucky and it'll build on its energy, right? Can get big? Can yeah, get bigger? Works. Because I'm still hoping for some rain. We have two more days of a chance of rain, and then it's no rain for like five days, I see. A little storm. I think the whole storm looked like it only took up like half a mile of space. Maybe a mile. <laughs> we'll see if we get any of it. I just hope it starts expanding into a big blob of rain. <laughs> it looks like they might be getting it at Ursula's look right there. But I know it's like deceiving, right? 
Well, I think if we're getting it here, they're getting the edges of it. Oh my goodness, look at this out here. So there's the airport that way. And we're probably right about that way, right yeah. where the cluster of trees is, straight back. Right there. Oh yeah, there is one coming. Really? Yeah. Let's see if I can get it. I can't even see anything. We're too far. A big one? Yeah. See it? Oh yeah, look, I do see it. Watch when we turn this corner. Oh, that was a big plane too. Where did it go? It did went, it landed on I it. might have You'll missed see it. Over it. Here. There's actually um, a museum that we went to one time down in Hendersonville. Oh yeah. Remember? It was cool, right? I think that they actually even, kids can take lessons there. just like a slight little line. I mean, it's not going to come this way anymore. <laughs> Do you want to attempt to mow it? I oh, know. I think I see black in the road there. No. It's close. Yeah, it's super close. Yeah, see how the, how the road is, is it getting grayer because it's going to rain? I don't know. <laughs> we'll be pushing it. Do you want to try? Yeah. Nothing better to do, right? <laughs> Might be raining in our house right there. Yeah. I think it definitely is raining in our house. We live on the next street. It's like sunny in his house. It's so weird. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I don't think we're doing this. <laughs> And the sirens went off. I don't know, buddy. That's a little too close for comfort, man. Eh, we'll be all right. Really? No, I'm joking. It's a big open field. Oh, you're the one mowing it. <laughs> Let's see. No, it's not even that long. It's not even It's long. That's long. Still 
see your stripes in it. Oh, his hell is drying off. Oh boy. Yeah. But this is like our house. We can drive straight across this through them houses and we live right there. He must water. His looks decent. He this guy like, waters. Oh I, yeah. You know this guy waters. Look at his one. Wow. Yeah. wow. That's what happens when you order, guys. Yeah, we ain't doing this one. No. I, I was hoping by the time we turn around, it would go away, but... I mean, but even if it does go away within, like, an hour, we can still come back and do it. I just... Yeah. You don't want to take the chance when we hear thunder that close. No. Well, let's check the radar. I just got an alert on my phone, so... You want to take the shortcut, Rach, down to the road? Yeah. What's going on now? Ah, uh, there must have been an accident. Oh, darn. We're not even going to be able to get home. Yeah, we will. They're letting people go through. What the heck happened down there? Oh, no. Or is it at the house? Something must be at the house. A fire? Um, we're going to go that way. One way. Uh-oh. You got it. Sure? Yeah. You're fine. Got it? Keep going. I always think I'm gonna hit that. Man, I can turn pretty tight, but I think I hit my trailer. Turn it that tight. That's where the siren came from. Ah man, this is just a little tease. See it's not raining yet. Yeah, but I heard that big thunder. That's not worth it, man. Hoping it fills in, you know, fills in a little bit just to give us some rain. Hopefully at our house. I emptied my gauges. We'll see if this does anything. I hope so. I planted seeds. Oh, baby, bring it on. Bring it on like Donkey Kong. Yeah, I think she's trying to water, but... Let's see, we were supposed to mow this one. It looks like it really needs to be cut, too. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go see what's going on down here, guys. Be nosy. Look, there's somebody's chicken. <laughs> you sure that's not your chicken? Hopefully it's not ours, all the way over here. <laughs> that would be funny, though. <laughs> right? Ah, oh, here it comes. I want a quick quarter inch at least, you know? Oh, Aww, he, he was about to mow. Oh, that stinks. He's gonna mow, see? You think he's gonna mow? Yeah. Maybe. No, thank you. Oh, boy, this is gonna be fun. Bring it on. So fun. that other guy isn't mowing the church either. He's he pulled out behind us. Yeah. So it says this is not at our house, but it definitely is because we're not even a mile down that yeah. way. And if we're getting it here, we're definitely getting at our house. So we're only all gonna hope it's about an inch or a half inch. I'd be happy with a quarter inch at this point. Yeah, it needs the rain, rain, rain. Now what happened here? Was there an accident? There's more fire trucks up there. Is there? No, yeah. something's going on up at the house. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't think them fire trucks are going to that thing. I think they were from somewhere else. Oh, yeah, there's something behind me. I'm trying to go. Oh, yeah. More. Oh, no, they're going the other way. They are? No, they're behind me. I don't know where they're trying to go. There's one behind me flashing, but I can't pull over. And he could go forward if he really needed to. Maybe lightning hit a tree and knock something down. Ooh. Like that.
Yeah. I just didn't see it from up there, I guess. That's a fire tanker. Well, because then it must have been some type of fire. Because remember, we don't have hookups here. So there must have been a call for some type of fire if that's a water tanker, right? Yeah. Guess what, you guys? Nobody has won the candy factory yet. Yeah, Rachel's been hunting. Been well, looking. I haven't been hunting. Well, I've been, been researching. Um, Hey, so if any of you guys up in Michigan... It's Michigan, Ohio, Illinois, Indiana, and Texas. Nobody right? else can take the ticket or take it because it's the only people who bought a ticket. Right. So, so they but would if have you guys to help us buy this, we'll split it. Oh my gosh, we would so split the candy shop. Or I mean, like you run the candy yeah, shop. Yeah, if you wanted to move and run the candy shop, that would be perfect. <laughs> we would just help you manage it. Look, the rain slowed down already. It's crazy and it gets so hot in here. Weaving us through. Wow. Oh my goodness. What the heck happened? Oh my goodness. I have never seen this many Oh yeah, something happened on that. Did the trailer tip on that? I wonder how that happened on that. Oh boy. So guys, we don't know what happened over at that thing. I've never seen, there were, we counted there were eight or nine fire trucks, EMSs. I know there's a whole family of people that live up there. Maybe something bad happened. I hope not. But let's see what we got here as far as rain goes. Man, it cooled off big time. Okay. Grand total from our downpour was... A little bit less than a quarter inch. Hey, any bit helps. Any bit helps. Look, guys. I am not going to complain about us not being able to go back to work probably today. We'll have to check and see what it is after we get it. I wish my hanging baskets were a little bit lower, but I heavily watered them this morning. So, we'll see what happens. Hopefully we get at least a quarter inch to a half inch. Now I don't have to water anything. So the bad news is, guys, we couldn't go back out to work because it kept on raining. But that's good news because I think we got a decent amount of rain. I'm going to check it real quick and see. Um, and we're supposed to get more rain tonight, more rain tomorrow. That means I don't have to water any of this. I can concentrate on getting some more of these pots in the ground. Um, we didn't get much mowing today. We didn't do much mowing today. But um, it is supposed to dry up next couple of days. We'll get out tomorrow and do some more mowing. Um, we're not behind it by any means because everything was dry. But this is going to make everything grow. And something else, in two weeks, around the 22nd, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, um, you guys won't see it on the Weather Channel because it's so far out. It's a person I watch um, that does a lot of weather. There's a Category 2 hurricane coming. Um, and I hope it doesn't get that bad. But it's supposed to maybe come into the Gulf from uh, the Pacific side across the Yucatan and um, form into a tropical low and then come up the Texas coast, maybe go in a little bit and then come up and ride into the uh, Ohio Valley, the Tennessee Valley. And I think they're saying we're supposed to maybe get six, seven inches of rain out of this. Let's hope not that much, but um, and let's hope it just stays a tropical storm. So I'm going to do some more work out here. Um, until tomorrow, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, guys, be happy. Have a good night. So let's check our rain gauges that Rachel bought us out here. 
before I go in and then we'll come out and do some more work. Okay guys, so according to the rain gauge, we have almost got three quarters of an inch of rain. Nice, nice. Like I said, I don't have to water anything out here now. Um, I will have to resume watering anything in pots tomorrow if it does not rain, um, because pots dry out really quick. But nice, let's see the big rain gauge, how much we got in the big rain gauge. Yeah, so on the big rain gauge, it actually says half inch. We actually, actually says we got over an inch. So I'm gonna say we got three quarters of an inch of rain. That's good.